Hello everybody and welcome back to another stream of Virtually Heroes. I'm Null and this is Bengali. Howdy. Hello Muskie, thank you for joining us in the stream today. How's everyone doing? So uh, today we're going to be uh, starting out with... Yeah, we should make, probably move that up, actually. Oh, that. I had moved that. Apparently I didn't move it enough. There we go. We'll go a little bit more. There we go. All right. Uh, so today we're going to be uh, starting out with uh, Final Fantasy Mystic Quest. Uh, we're going to be doing this for 40 to 60 minutes. And then we'll uh, probably switch over to uh, StarCraft after that. And do a few missions there. Uh, so last time we left off on uh, Final Fantasy, um, we had just... Uh, found the ice giant uh, we were struggling a little bit uh, died a couple times so off screen I did do a, a little bit of grinding I have uh, killed all of the uh, monsters and I went out and uh, filled up on cure potions uh, heal potions got some refreshers I also I did a little bit of seed grinding, uh, so uh, with that, uh, all of our magic is full and we're ready to take on the ice giant. Uh, you also got a new armor. Yep. So unfortunately, while I was doing off-screen uh, grinding, uh, without even thinking about it, I opened a uh, chest, that, not realizing I should wait until I'm recording for that. Uh, but I got some noble armor, uh, defense power 12. It's got the water droplet and the potion bottle. I actually looked up what the different signs mean, but I forget. Does that mean that you have water resistance? I forget. Okay, well, <laughs> can you look at her armor? Because she gets water resistance. Does she? Yes. Uh, so she's got the water droplet, so I'm assuming the water droplet is water resistance then. I don't know what the other symbols are. I think that ring gives you a silence resistance, because someone tried to silence you before. Is that what that is? Yes. Okay. So her and I both have that silence resistance. And she's got that tornado looking thing and I've got this potion looking thing. Is there like an arrow or a wind spell in this? Um yes. I don't know if they're tied or not. Um Another thing that happened off stream is I uh, had a little spoiler for myself, which I remember now from when I played this as a kid, but at the time I uh, hadn't remembered it. And um, so I'm not going to spoil it for any of the viewers. You get to uh, experience it on your own. Uh, but I do prefer to have like genuine reactions to stuff as they happen. Uh, so I've decided that any more grinding that I do, I am going to uh, just kind of do impromptu unscheduled streams for those. And those just won't be uploaded to YouTube. Uh, so anyone who wants to, you know, see the grind can tune in on uh, Twitch for those as they come up. Anyone who doesn't want to can tune in for the regular Twitches or watch the videos on YouTube. And I believe that's all we have to announce. Shall we get into the Ice Giant? Sure. Waha. I'm enjoying our little game. 
And he's gone. Me? Yeah, so uh, when I was uh, doing some grinding, uh, if you uh, recall, I had to fall down a hole to get here. Uh, well, since I fell down a hole, you can't go back the way that you came in, and I wanted to do grinding in other areas. So I had to go this way. And there's some monsters along this way, which I already cleared out from grinding. Uh, but uh, the ice giant... I was going to say, that looked like it was another one of the statues that you uh, stabbed. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but the ice giant reappears here, so I knew that he was going to disappear and come here. Don't fall. Yeah. Don't fall. You think you're a knight, huh? Fwaha! Take this! Uh, but yeah, now that we're leveled up, I'm level 20, Phoebe's still level 15. Uh, we've got full magic, full health, uh, we're completely decked out. We shouldn't have too much trouble with this. Wow, he did a lot of damage to her. Yeah, he did. You have her own manual? Uh, she wasn't supposed to be. I hit the wrong button. Ice block! Strong against water attack. So yeah, that should... That water droplet appears to be water resistant. Excellent! Uh, let's try some, uh, fire damage. Makes sense to me. Weak, weak against to fire. Huzzah! I'm surprised she's not using fire. Does she have fire? I don't know. I forget if she has fire or not. Yeah, she has fire. Oh. I wonder why she's not using it. Whatever. Hypnosleep. I don't need to worry about it, because Phoebe's got all the potions she can possibly need. If she goes through all of those potions, I'll be upset. Legitimately. There we go. Uh, so I have been getting a lot of uh, feedback from people watching the stream, as well as uh, some people watching the uh, YouTube videos. Uh, about our audio being a little bit quiet. Uh, we do have a uh, microphone stand on order, uh, but it's not going to be here until Saturday. But hopefully starting Saturday we'll have uh, some... we'll be able to position the microphone better for everyone. That's the hope at least. Um... Or if we really wanted to, we could just get a second microphone. Which I've thought about doing that too, like really? lapel mics or something for us. I don't know how much those cost and if we want to invest in that at this point, but it's worth looking into. Definitely have to put that onto our notes or something like that. I also want to play with this a little bit because I know there's different uh, settings that it can be set on. Right now we have it set on uh, the best setting for this setup, at least. Yeah, but uh, when we move the microphone, like if we move it closer, it might need to listen from both sides. So we might need to change that. Eh, there's a setting for that, so... Yeah. Yay! Huzzah! Didn't break a sweat. So I am curious. There, at the beginning of the game, there's five crystals. Uh, what's the 
or I'm assuming that the crystals are supposed to be earth, water, fire, and wind. I think there's six. There's six? What are the fifth and sixth ones then? There's six or seven. No? They're multiplying! We can look that up later. Yeah, we can. If... Are you too afraid that this is going to show up on our stream? It's actually not. I actually want it to so people can see what we're doing. I'm just scrubbing through a video real quick. For those of you wondering what I'm doing. We... I'm just looking through the two videos. I'm not going to go any deeper than that. Well, if you chose one of the ones where we started the the cards, um, or putting the cards into the videos, it actually has a has the thing on it. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Okay, yeah, five crystals. I thought there was more than that. Yeah, I had to look that up or it was going to bother me for a long time. Alright, uh, so that one's you. You get to speak. Well, you're you. Uh, well, you didn't say that line, did you? I didn't say the line before that either, but you clicked through it. Oh, did I? Yeah. Okay. Bye! <laughs> Yay, Crystal! Huzzah! And our comrade has left. Got the river coin, which I believe that should let us enter the second area of the temple. There's a second area to this place? Uh, not of this place, but uh, the uh, main tower in the center of the map. Ah. Oh, right. Okay. And I believe here-ish was where the chest was for the uh, armor. Secret doors. Yeah. NES games were amazing with hiding secret passageways just in a wall where you can't even tell it's there until you randomly bump into the wall because you've lost your mind trying to figure out where to go. Been days playing a single game just trying to get to the next area because you can't find it. You ever have those experiences? Uh, not days. What uh, video game consoles uh, have you had growing up? I don't think you ever told me. Uh, we had an Atari. Uh, that was the very first one that we had. Didn't have very many games for it. Any of our systems, we never had very many games. Uh, so Grandma also bought us uh, Nintendo. And uh, we, we also got a Super Nintendo. It wasn't until we were in high school. No, late middle school. That... Um, we got our first uh, Sega Genesis. Hmm. Sega. That was one of my favorites. Uh, cutting you off, uh, but everything's thawed. Yay! Yay! And didn't uh, it say that we could grind seeds somewhere? Was that um, in the town, or where was that I at? think that was in the town. Like in the middle area? Nothing there. 
I know there's an area under this house that we couldn't get to before, but this is like a whole dungeon area. Oh, wow. I think we'll come back to that. Uh, when so, are we getting the dungeon installed in our house? Right. Uh, what'd you get after the... Uh, Muskie the says, I just find the doors. Yeah, I saw that. <clears throat> Uh, we also had a Nintendo 64, and the very first system I bought for myself was a GameCube, and oh, yeah. it was the Platinum Special Edition one. Okay. Even got a wave bird for it. A wave bird? What's that? The wave bird was the wireless controller for the GameCube. Oh, it yeah. ran off of batteries, so... Um, but the batteries tended to last quite a bit. It was nice. It also made uh, cheating for my sister more difficult. <laughs> Is your sister a cheater? She can be a little bit of a sore loser. <laughs> uh, especially in racing games. Like, it, or there have been a couple of times where we've... Uh, Play racing games together, and if I were winning, she would yank my controller <laughs> out of the thing. Yeah. Oh. The, right, the first time we, or I used the wave bird, and I was winning in a racing game on GameCube. I believe it was actually Mario Double Dash. Yeah. She reached over and was like, "There's nothing for me to pull." <laughs> yeah, I'll admit I'm actually a big cheater when it comes to playing games, but. Uh, I also really only play like single player games uh, most of the time uh, where it's not affecting anybody's uh, game experience except my own. I don't cheat on multiplayer games. Some awful news made Captain Mac race from his home. Anyway. Seek Reuben and Fireberg. Say, what's this statue for? Thank you, Captain Cryptic. Alright, so that goes there so I can jump across. Blizzard! I got a new spell book. Yay! I don't know if that statue is going to stay there if I leave the temple though, so I don't know how I'm supposed to get there. And then there's this locked chest. I don't know where I'm supposed to get a key for that. So if I leave the temple, is that uh, pillar going to be where I put it? Pillar? Yeah, I just moved a pillar. I'm sorry, I didn't see. The old man said, hey, what's that pillar for? And I pushed it. What's that statue for? That's a statue, not a pillar. Same thing. It decidedly is not. Okay, yeah, so it stayed there. I don't know how I'm supposed to get down to that lower level, but it stayed there. Maybe if we go through the door number two. What is behind door number two? It opened! Huzzah! Yeah, 
Yeah, my first game console, I actually skipped the Atari, went to the NES, and then the SNES, and then got an Atari. Uh, so the Atari was actually my third console. And unfortunately, a, a friend from school accidentally blew it up. An Atari? Yep. How? He wanted to play my Atari, and the power cable was unplugged, so I told him to just, you know, fidget with the wires and find the power cable and plug it in. And it, it was my fault, but uh, he did. And um, the power cable that he grabbed was actually for our wireless house phone. So oh. when he plugged it in, he fried the uh, Atari. Oh. A guy came in saying he could open any lock. Sounds like a handy craft to have. Yeah, especially when it comes to chests that you don't know where to find keys for. Exactly. I'm actually very good at picking locks. Well, I wouldn't say very good. I can. I know how. Oh, I, you. I know that... Well, there are tons of monsters in a mine up in north! Okay, what were you going to say before I cut you off? Uh... Talking about picking locks? I know the theory behind it. But I don't think I've actually uh, successfully ever done it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, I actually had a uh, co-worker who locked his uh, keys in his car and was uh, about to call a locksmith to get into his car. And I was like, you know, save yourself 50 bucks. Give me just couple minutes with your car I'll see if I can get you in and I slid a uh, string into the window and uh, was able to uh, loop it around the uh, uh, the pop-up lock on the door and was able to pull his lock open I worked on it for maybe about 30 seconds before I had it open Wow yeah that's horrifying yeah they were like thanks but that's really creepy. <laughs> uh, so I've only got 6,000 gold, and this person is wanting to oh, sell man. me their axe for five. For 500. Oh, I thought it was 5,000. Okay. Yeah, we can buy that. Huzzah! Axe upgrade! I hope you're happy with your battle axe! Do we have that? Nope. I like the music in this place. It's kind of jamming. Right. It's uh, kind of jamming music considering they're going through earthquakes and trying not to die. A mask lets you see the monsters through the gas in the volcano. What gas? What volcano? You just left the other way and came back into the town the other direction? Magic. Okay. <laughs> Take a nice rest. Blah, blah, blah. No thanks. How about some seeds? Okay, so we can buy seeds here. Nice. I'd like to help you, but you have enough cure potions. Yes, yes I do. Nice to meet you again, kid. I think this is Reuben, the guy that we need. No? Okay. Want to listen to this band? Sure! I 
I turned up the volume. I'm sorry if you hear it twice. Okay, I think that's enough. <clears throat> that is jamming, though. <laughs> Eventually, I do plan on, like, getting us some nice comfy headphones so we don't need to worry about sound coming from the TV into the microphone. <clears throat> you have enough explosives. <laughs> yes, yes, I do. I guess Musket was entertained by our little dance party. Right. I hope so. Are you not entertained? Can I make that reference at least once every stream? You're Reuben, huh? Have you heard about the Crystal of Fire? I can't deal with that now. I've got to help Dad. He looks like a robot. What's a robot? A robot! Did you... Did, did, did you get the reference? No. Oh, sad face. What? Well, why don't you let me help you? Exclamation mark instead of question mark. He's stuck behind a boulder. There'd be no problem if we had a mega grenade, but only Dad's friend can use them. Where's the guy's house? In this town, but he shut himself in. We'll pay him a visit anyways. Come on! Yay! Level 23! I'm the runt again. Muskie says that headphones or earphones are essential. Yeah. I've got a really nice pair that I use for my uh, computer. Yeah, we've both got nice uh, headphones, but uh, we need to get like splitters and probably extension cables and stuff. We just haven't gotten there yet. Baby steps. Hi, Clips. Welcome to the stream. Yay, Clips. Hello. Can you actually hear us this time? That one's yours. I just did the robot voice. Fine. You can't let a monster get the best of you. Am I wrong, though? He looks like a robot. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. I think it's locked. You should probably go check somewhere else or try and find the guy who can open any lock. I think that guy is in there. Or maybe he's the thief that's in the hotel? Is there a thief in the hotel? The guy that you had in, like, the first dungeon. Or the second dungeon. Oh, the guy that I talked to. Yeah. What's up? We went to the house in the pit, but the guy wouldn't let us in. I just realized that this guy has no idea what we're talking about. <laughs> He's like, good job. Congratulations. You two want in? Then take this. Received multi-key. Who needs to pick a lock when you have a key that'll open them all? Eclipse says I think it's locked. I don't believe you. Let's check. It opened. It's not locked. <laughs> I ran when I saw the monsters in the volcano. A huge boulder fell and trapped Aaron? Arian. Arian? Only a mega grenade can free him. How do you use one? Just throw it! 
Ta da! Grenade upgrade! Go through the abandoned mine to reach the boulder! Alright, so we've actually uh, already gotten a bomb upgrade. At the end of our last room, we got a sword upgrade. Uh, we got a battle axe upgrade. So we've upgraded three things uh, fairly quickly. Uh, and we've been streaming for half an hour. How long do we want to be streaming for? Uh, well, this is probably a good point to take a break unless you want to try and get find the next dungeon at the very least. I kind of think this might be a good spot to stop. We just uh, finished clearing this town. Okay. And now we can go the other direction. And the ground shakes every time we move. Is there like a volcano in this area? There is. Uh, and, and you can't really see it because the emulator is skipping every other frame, but the ground is shaking here. But there's a volcano. Oh, cool. I didn't actually realize this. Are you on a track? Are on a rail, basically. Uh, no. What are you calling a rail? Like, you have the two arrows. Uh, does that mean that you press up to go, or and you'll automatically move to the next point? Yeah. Okay. Because uh, I didn't realize that. I thought that's okay, Eclipse. That's all right. We appreciate you. Uh coming and uh, visiting with us. We are going to go ahead and take our five minute break though. So Eclipse, Musky, everyone else, we'll see you in five minutes after I retrieve my mouse that I threw across the room haphazardly. Hello everyone and thank you very much for watching. Be sure to comment down below to let us know what you thought of the episode. If you liked what you saw, please hit that uh, like button, and if you'd like to be notified of future videos, be sure to subscribe and hit that bell icon. We will see you in the next video.